A baby in Miami-Dade County is safe and back home tonight after a terrifying day for his family. Someone stole their SUV with that 10-month-old inside. CBS 4's Amber Diaz is live in Miami Gardens where that stolen vehicle ended up. Amber. Yes, we learned the, learned the person responsible for this whole mess is actually a 15-year-old boy. Now, we do know the name, but we're not revealing it because he is a minor. But what we do know by police is that he tried hiding inside this Home Depot right behind me before, right after, actually, he crashed that woman's car. A family is safe, but silent tonight after a hellish ordeal. It was sad, very sad. Their 10-month-old was inside this black infinity when a 15-year-old boy stole it from their driveway and crashed four miles away. I saw the, the, the accident, you know what I mean? I heard the police. Elvis Perez, who waxed his cars here, says chaos erupted outside his job. And they say the, the key was inside, so I saw the police grabbing the key. Miami-Dade police say mom, Angie Barrios, had just arrived at her home in Palm Springs North. She parked her car and was headed for the front door. When she turned around, the brazen boy jumped in the driver's seat and took off with her baby still inside. He crashed her car into a light pole in front of the Miami Lakes Auto Mall. The young driver was arrested minutes later after trying to hide inside the nearby Home Depot. I recommend all of the uh, uh, parents try to, every time you, you go somewhere, you hide your key inside, take it out. It's not, it's, it's not a big deal. For me, it's not a big deal today because something like that was happening. Thankfully, the baby boy was not injured and was reunited with his mother. Now back out here live outside the Home Depot in Miami Gardens. Now the baby's father assured us his little boy is doing just fine. Again, he did not want to speak on camera. Meanwhile, police are still looking for a four-door Nissan Altima that was also involved in this incident. Reporting live in Miami Gardens, Amber Diaz, CBS 4 News, tonight.